Hi, we're just introducing this beautiful Bluthner uh, Grand Piano, six foot three in length, um, style seven. And uh, on the actual soundboard, it's got the number 30213, which you will find is uh, 1890s. Um, it's been beautifully restored. Um, the casework is perfect. It's only just come from the factory. Um, and the people who do this also do Steinway. Um, it is uh, a fabulous finish. Um, the action has been regulated and it came out of a private home um, and uh, it was obviously very well cared for because when it came back from the polishing, it was completely in, uh, in tune uh, concert pitch. So it, it is an amazing piano, but I think when you hear it, these, some of these pianos have a certain uh, tone. This has that tone. It has a great rich bass. It has a fantastic treble. Um, and you'll see that in single notes, it makes such a difference to the actual playing of it. Um, not only that, it looks absolutely stunning, you know, um, uh, and we don't have this in our shop. I have this at home because when we get a piano like this, you don't want, um, you know, customers to put microphones on them or guitars or whatever. So it's only come straight from the polishers here, which is what we do with these classic pianos that we, uh, um, that we have repolished. I'll uh, let you hear uh, the beautiful sound of this piano. Uh, I'll do uh, lots of pieces so that we can hear the bass, the treble uh, and uh, the top. It's beautiful, it, it, it works really well. It plays, it's, the actual action is not as heavy as you would get on a Steinway or whatever. So, uh, you know, a pianist will love playing this. Um, I'll uh, start now.
Okay, from that little demonstration, uh, what I tried to do then was show you the full range of the piano. Um, the, 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 the strings are still retain all that beautiful tone. Um, the keys work perfectly. The actual keys themselves, um, they look all original to me, but may possibly have had um, an upgrade in the sort of 50s, 60s. It's very hard to tell. They're obviously not the original uh, ivories, uh, but sometimes, you know, you do get them like this um, from the 1920s, 30s, so they could have been put on by then. Um, they play great. Um, uh, the action is really, really nice to play, but I was just showing you all the different range uh, uh, and tone of this beautiful piano. Thank you.